I spent on this car. Uh, all right, so this is gonna be the estimated value because I'm still gonna be dumping money into this thing. Uh, this Cobra hood right here, I got it out of a, uh, off of the marketplace. It's OEM, paid $350 for it. Uh, it started off as yellow. It was on my 96 Mustang GT, but I went on to put it on this one because I want to do something different. Uh, my Cobra, the Cobra bumper, uh, that was about a hundred and something dollars. I got it for my dad's job. Uh, the wheels, I paid about $1,800 for that. Uh, the Cerrone side scoops, I paid 120, 20 something dollars for. The Celine spoiler, I paid, I think it was like two something for. Um, now, if you wanna start going under the hood, This was about, I want to say about 60 some dollars, maybe 80 some dollars. I can't really recall. The cold air intake, that was like 60 some dollars. The cap and rotor, I think was 60 some dollars as well. And that's as far as as many miles as I have done. Um, I started replacing hoses, so that's about, you know, 20 some dollars. Um, but what started getting expensive was the paint. That's where it started getting expensive. So paint, if I had to say how much money I've spent it's probably close to two grand. And it's just painting here and there, the hood, the bumper, uh, the side scoops, uh, the tail lights, uh, the spoiler, the fender. Uh, I mean, my, my goodness, though, I mean, it's flawless. Yeah, I say a, a two grand wor looks, worth it. It looks good on camera, but it looks better in, in person. person. Camera don't even do it just, I tell you that. Let these guys know about the um, the HIDs that you got installed. Oh, so yeah, I forgot to include those. So the, the headlight bulbs, they were 130 some dollars. And then the fog lights, they were 120 some dollars. But um, I was always going for the overall look of uh, being that that Xenon look or LED look yeah. rather. And I could never pull it off because I tried the, the headlight bulbs from from Rock Auto and stuff like that. And they had the blue look, but they just weren't bright enough. Right. So I said, you know what, uh, let me try something different. And so I went out there to a local uh, parts shop. Uh, they said, that, yeah, they got them in, so bought them. And now the price did discourage me a little bit because the headlights. Yeah. But I said, you know what, why not? If you want to look good, you got to pay for it. got to so pay for it, yes, sir. Put them in there, and I haven't looked back yet. <laughs> it definitely gives it a modern look. It looks good, man. Uh, you guys probably seen the video of him installing those bad boys and the difference between like the yellowish and uh, the, the cool blue look, night and day. Let me wipe my camera lens because it looks like it's a little smudge on one of them. So I know a lot of you guys have been asking, um, got a lot of you guys been asking how much he spent on this car because we posted the video maybe about three or four months ago saying that he got this car for 500 bucks. But you guys can see the condition that it was in when he got it. I mean, it was still a flawless, good-looking car overall. But, of course, he put his own touch into it as well. So, I mean, here are some before pictures of it now. I mean, it's it's night and day different. It didn't have the hood. It didn't have the bumper. It didn't have no wing. Uh, definitely, the wheels weren't on here. I actually have the original wheels over there on the side that came on the car when I first got it. So this is, I think, 15 by 8 and then 15 by 10 over there. I'm going to get some new tires because I want to show everybody how the car looked before the, uh, the SVEs were on here. So it was a... Uh, one. When these tires, when the original wheels were on there, this car was, I mean, it was even lower than it is now. And it looked hella good. Mm -hmm. And he said he's not nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. Never be, finished. never be finished. So for you guys that's been wondering all along, that's the, uh, 
that's the total right there. Uh, we did all the calculations and the breakdown, and it's this is just an estimate of what everything costs to get it to its, ter its, its current state. So, it's, it's a dope car, though. I mean, look at that thing. That's a, that's a mean car. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We're gonna wrap it up. Still got more to come. We ain't even got to the headers. Damn, look at them. We ain't talking about the headers. Yeah, fender flares, the fuse on the way. Oh yeah. Go out here and play a little ball with the fellas, man. Show how, show them how it's done. Show them how it's done. See, broke. Come on.